it is charismatic coach Cassie here. I get a lot of questions about cloth diapering. I've been cloth diapering for two and a half years now and I'm on my second kid and I love, love, love cloth diapering. Seriously, it's an obsession and it's easy and I just can't believe how different it is than what I thought before I was a mom. I was like not interested, yuck, no, but it's great. So I'm gonna show you guys how I do so it. Here's my setup, change in table. I have two diaper genies and I labeled them. This one is for trash, and this one is for diapers. I just changed my baby. So here is a dirty cloth diaper. Take the wipe, put it in there. And these are like, um, you cannot smell it at all. See, I pushed it under there. Take the diaper just as it is. I do not spray them out. I don't wash them in the toilet. I literally just put it in there. If there is um, big chunks of poop, I will scrape it out with a wipe and put that in here because this gets out to the trash every, you know, at least once a week once it gets full. Um, and then the diapers, I will show you how to wash them. When this diaper genie is full, just take it out. It's in a cloth bag. And bring it to the wash. Now, in the laundry room, this is the part that I thought was kind of gross. You're washing dirty, poopy diapers in your washer. Um, if you have a good washer, decent washer, it works. I don't even like this washer. It's a high efficiency one. So it doesn't use a ton of water so I'll show you my steps um, but it were eight I wash regular clothes right after these and they do not smell like poop so this is the bag I took from there what I do there's no wipes or anything in here I just made sure it's just the cloth diapers and all I do is I like separate because there's a diaper a liner a pad and then the liner and I just separate them I only do that because I've found that it washes them better um, but you can just dump the whole bag in there. You can definitely dump the whole bag. I'm just gonna open these up. They wash good, but like I said, I just like to, I'm not touching any poop, I'm just touching the liner. You can also wear a glove if you want to. It does stink, because that's like three days old of diapers. I take my detergent and I pour it in there and I put my setting on heavy oh because I have a high this is just water in here but because I have a washer that doesn't it goes by weight I add water on the diaper so they're heavier so when it fills up with water it fills more water in there just because of this type of washer which is why I don't like it I put it on deep clean hot water and then heavy duty and start then when the washer is done I take the liners and these I hang up um, because they are waterproof and I was told to not dry them because it makes them last longer so I hang them I'll show you after this where I hang them but the pads these go in the dryer so simple that's it here they are straight from the washer um, I hang them on this I got it at Amazon it's very very cheap but I got it like three years ago so um, I don't remember the price but they're just little clips and you can hang clothes on there these are, these are not wet when they come out of the dryer. They're not like dripping wet, so you don't have to worry about anything. You can hang them on the back of a chair. You can hang them on a drying rack, wherever you um, can hang these where, if you don't want to buy one of these. But I love these just because it's nice. And this is the bag that we washed. It also hung dry because it is smell-proof and waterproof. So get them all hung up then. So 
these are called pocket diapers, and these are actually snapped up right now because he's only seven months old, um, and once he grows a little bit bigger, you unsnap them and they get bigger for the toddler. Um, I wanted to show you guys a tip for the pocket diapers. They're called pockets because there's this back pocket, and you can actually, you're supposed to put this pad in there. I stopped doing that because it was terrible. When I had to wash them, I had to pull the pad out, and it was just, it wasn't convenient at all. So I started just setting them in there and I fold them and that's how I put them on the baby. And if you snap it right, it's tight enough. This is not going to slide around. So I don't understand why you should have to put it in the pocket. Um, so if you're struggling with pocket diapers, try that. Um, it's a crazy time saver. And sometimes just this part gets dirty. Like if it's a really little poop or just one pee, um, you can actually just throw this in your diaper pail and use this again, put an extra pad on here. Just my other tip.